What's up? My name is Zom Dude, and welcome to Inscription, a horror card game that also doubles as an escape room game. You'll see. This is uh, okay. probably one of my favorite indie horror games of 2020-2021. This is also made by the creator of Pony Island, if you remember that game from way back when. I didn't play it personally on here at all, but you know, so. Heard good things about that game. Continue. It's been a while since I've played this game, so I've forgotten mostly all of it. has been ages. Perhaps you've forgotten how this game is played. Allow me to remind you. Okay, dude. What do you say? Play the squirrel card. Now play a stoat. Stoats cost one life. Sacrifices must be made. An honorable death. Play the stoat. Require two sacrifices. You don't have enough. Ring the bell to end your turn and commence combat. It's one shaky bell. Your stoat stands unopposed. The number on the bottom left is, it a, is its attack power. One. Oh, right. I forgot about the scale. Or at least what you put on the scale. Your stoat dealt one, dealt me one damage. I added it to the scale. You win if you tip my side all the way down. Like this. My turn. Your stoat stands in the way of my coyote. Coyote. My coyote dealt, dealt two damage to your stoat. That means your stoat's health is to us. A creature's health reaches zero, it dies. It's your turn again. You may draw from your deck, or you may draw a square. Draw a square. How dumb. The wolf demands two sacrifices. Is it pulsating? Am I, am I seeing m magic? <laughs> Huh? Wait, wait, okay. Fear not. The beast is sacrificed, but not removed from your deck. Its suffering is real, but you will see it again. God, I... My ears are itchy. Because you are learning, I will pass. Again, the choice a random card for you from your deck. The certainty of a squirrel. This is a fun game, by the way. If you have not heard or played this game, I definitely recommend you do. Um, it's pretty good. I, I enjoy it quite a bit. In fact, I think it's a, it's a pretty good game. Yeah, so I enjoy it. Three damage dealt, three weights on the scale. Pause. Do, 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 do. You've won this match. They, they won't all be so easy. Let me recall your story. Oh, yes. You were lost deep in the forest. A single path revealed itself. I like the way this guy narrates things. It's a really um It's a it's really storytelling. It gives a lot of flavor to the game as you go on. It's really cool. Two denizens of the forest approached you tentatively. The caustic adder damage from its poison bite is always lethal. The undying cat sacrifices. Sacrificing the poor beast does not kill it. Another creature joins your caravan. 
this guitar, by the way, I love this part. This specific song in the soundtrack is so good to me. You came across an abandoned sack. You found a squirrel in the bottle. Break in case of an emergency. And have a settlement. Another useful implement. It'll allow you to dip the squirrels with it. And not in the way you're thinking. Three is as much as you can carry. You were ambushed while crossing this rough terrain. It was the right play. I get it. Maybe. You'll help me? Take your turn. Play along for now. Okay, man, if you say so, like if you tell me to play along, I'll play along with me. There's a bit of that. Also, I have a... There we go. That should be better for you guys. Um, you may now see my moves ahead of time. Yeah, this is part of the game. You get to see it. Behold the rule book. Yeah, we got a rule book now. Uh, put you, put you, play you, but you. Back. Here we go. Oh, I thought I'd said something different. over creatures to attack directly. Ha! My bat flew right over your stout. This man seems to be enjoying this game of cards. Which I can respect. Everyone, I love a good game of cards myself. I should always go for a good round of cards. Cards. A serpent, perhaps more deadly. Just to add insult to injury, I want to do over damage. Because those, I'll tell you right now, those aren't pieces of what you think they are, they're teeth. And gaining those extra teeth, uh, you you keep those, and they're gonna come in handy useful. I remember that for a fact. You prevailed and trekked onward past the now bloody terrain. The young wolf cub it grows into a wolf after a single turn. The meek sparrow, an inexpensive if feeble flying creature. Take the wolf cub. You stumbled into some strange stones in the mist. You were compelled to choose a worthy sacrifice, one that will be lost forever. Adder. Let me kill it too. We can even to the river snapper. That's a good. That ooh, tanky. Tanky's poison snapper. A ghastly spectacle, but the soul of the adder now lives in the the snapper. Yeah. It's cool. I like these little like particles that happen. That's cool. It, do it just adds so much and the little like the faint but noticeable like color deterioration every here on the edges of certain things is it's just add this whole thing is just like it adds on to its own experience and I really like love it. Behold my totem inscribes my canine cards with the airborne sigil. Oh, that can't be good. He's completely, he's completely insane. You see that, right? No care for the rules. Pathetic, really. Enough. Watch me. Oh, it doesn't inscribe your K my K9 cards with the. Oh, that crap. My totem has granted my coyote the power of flight. Damn it. That's not good for me. Uh, um. No. 
<laughs> Back on the board. You know, I know a bit of trivia about this game because when I was young, when um, this game was brand new, I, I was obsessed with this game and I looked into it. There was a, uh, a game jam demo. You're four damage away from winning. Um, and that demo was called Sacrifices Must Be Made, which is kind of ironic considering the gameplay. Wait, uh, why am I just drawing square rolls? Eh, it doesn't matter anyways, we're gonna win. Impressive. You may yet survive this ordeal. Knock on wood. Guess I'll knock on my desk then, because that's wood. That. The cunning raven, the blight upon the skies. The watchful proclaim frog. It leaps in the way of attacking flyers. That seems like good. We came across a small group of survivors. Faces shrunken from starvation. They huddled around the campfire. They looked upon the group of creatures and beckoned. Come here. Warm one of the young creatures by the fire, one said. Warm it by the fire that will enhance its power, said another. You notice the survivors wiping drool from their mouth. <laughs> hmm. Let's have a tanky wolf cub. Oh, that does damage. Okay. One of the survivors reached towards it. Another gnashed their teeth. Without another word, you pulled the wolf cub away from the fire of madness. What's the fuck? What's that? Oh, that doesn't seem good. <laughs> There's a way out for both of us. It's somewhere in this foul cabin. Be silent or I will tear you to shreds. Oh shit. Two grizzlies. Ah shit. Um I don't think I have anything that can take this. This spot, you sure? No, I'm not sure at all, frankly. Uh oh, crap. <laughs> A well earned point of damage. I didn't think you'd really do it. Well, when people, when you're in a situation as bad as this, people tend to do desperate things. You know what I'm saying? Mm, I'm so dead. I am dead beyond belief. Ah. Uh, I'm dead beyond all belief. I'm dead. Ah, crap. You've lost. Using this as a learning opportunity may be only, the only way to mitigate my disappointment. Get up. Get up from the table. Fetch me the candlestick from top to, from my top to barrel besides the door. So this is the escape room part of the game I've mentioned. You can... after. After a bit of time, you can get up whenever you want, and you can interact with things around the up, around, around the cabin to do these little mini games, or not mini games, puzzles. Bring it here. Right there. Let's sit back down. Okay, man. Let me explain something to you. That was one of the two mistakes you can make here. If you make another, I must sacrifice you. Now where were we? The flighty elk moves after attacking. 
the stalwart snapper, a near impenetrable defense. I'll take the sparrow. I am not feeling good about this. A rock may get you out of the place. A powerful item this turn. Dear Nitz, and I'll skip my next turn. If you deem it necessary, you may cut up one of my cards with ease. I'll take that. I'll take that. Feeling overburdened with enough for the full three items you carried on. So what's going on here, huh? That doesn't seem good. The trees are seem to close in around you as a chill mist descending. In the distance, you could hear the clink of metal and stone. A hobble figure stood in your path. <laughs> Twas the prospector. <laughs> He's doing the prospector again? Easy boss. Mule's key. Mule's key, huh? Well, there's a mule. There's a pack mule. I don't know if it's gonna be the key, though. I don't think. I think he. Uh, okay. I'm not sure. It doesn't. It's possible that it's key. I, I mean, he's saying it's key. He's saying mule is key, but I'm not so sure. I, I don't I don't know about that. I'm, I'm a little skeptical. Either way, we'll damage it. Ah, crap. Uh, wolf cub. There. So many fucking coyotes. Uh. Gonna kill the, the pack mule. That's good. Uh, uh, oh! Hey, damn it! My mule! Ah, crap! Uh, well, that's a lot of cards. Ah, so many cards. Uh. sure what to play though. Put you there, I guess I'll put you there. I'm not sure what to play. Ah oh, Sigil will move to that space to receive the strike instead. Oh, that's bad. Oh, that's, nice. that's, a, that's bad. Okay. Uh, I'm afraid of losing. I don't want to lose. I don't remember what happens when you lose. I don't remember what happens when you lose. What happens if you lose? I hope you didn't think it would be that easy. Oh crap. There's gold in them cards! Oh crap. Oh crap. There's gold! I struck gold!
Child 13. What happened to Childs 1 through, th one through th that 1 through 12? With the sound of Prospector's pickaxe still ringing in your ears, you carried onwards. Ah, oh, oh, crap. Ah, I messed up. Ah, I fucking messed up. Ah, uh, maybe I can save it with this. Maybe. Okay, there we go. Maybe, please. Please. Uh, ah, crap. Ah, crap. How disappointing. So, what's this bear trap all around? Stalked along the way by a trapper looking to liquidate his pelts. There was something uncanny about his appearance, but you were quickly distracted by his wares. Care to look at me pelts? Take a pelt for your charge. See the quality. I, you'll need more teeth for that one. Wolf pelt. Take another rabbit pelt. You're, you're leaving already? Please concern me, me pelts. <laughs> Th thanks for your business. The man assured you of the value of the notes. They appear to be useless in the fight, but he mentioned that the trader further down the path would be, would reward you for them. Okay, what do we got? Fire! Ah, shit, I didn't see the fucking toad. Ah. Starving survivors stood around the dying campfire. There is room for a creature. A creature around the fire? One said. The warmth of the Lord enhance its power, said another. The survivors said nothing at all, but could but stop licking their lips. Oh, just let me button shirt. There we go. Uh, uh, um, hmm, who to the power of the river snapper was enhanced by the war. As one of the survivor, survivors began pulling a knife and from their pocket, he withdrew. Well, here comes my death. This ain't good. This is just as bad all around. This is just bad all around. This ain't good. For me. Ow. Uh, this is not good. God. Okay. Outpost post in the woods 
attended by a mysterious woman. It was the traitor that the, the mule of Trampa had mentioned. Her appearance is unsettling, but you might abide by her offerings. Do you mind if I examine those belts of yours? Let's start with your hair belts. Here's what I can offer. I can trade you any one of these. Take your time, dearie. Oh, wolf pelts too. Exquisite. These all don't seem like any good. I guess I'll pick a grizzly. These pelts are most excellent, my thanks. That seems like a boss up ahead. The wolf of the boat, the campfire was a little bit exciting. The though the dead, the hungry eyes around it, the dead, the green, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Warm a creature by the fire, enhance its power. smell invaded your nostrils. Oh, that's right. That's why that smells awful. And caused your throat to seize. A hulking man sat by the brackish pond with his feet submerged in the dark water. He pulled a hook from a pile of rotting fish and rose to his feet. I am the angler. Go fish. Doesn't seem good. Fresher fish, easy choose. I'm curious about what that hook does. Oh, that's fun. Might now go fish. That's fun, not really at all in the slightest. Ah. Uh, um, Think about that. Crap. Take new fish. Easy. Crap. Dogs. Fuck. Take fish. Go fish. Well, shit. Crap. Oh, go 
fish. Holy shit, holy shit. I hate it. I hate that. What am I seeing now? What am I seeing now? What am I seeing now, huh? What are we seeing? What are we seeing? What are we seeing? You aren't dead yet. This is a purgatory, though you may think of it that way. Before you expire, I must ask you a favor. I'd like a, a memento. From how far I got? Your very own death card. That's what they're called, okay. It's quite plain at the moment, isn't it? Yeah. We will work get together to amend that. Yeah, uh, sure, man. I want this to be the perfect memento of you. Well, that's not possible. Here are some cards from your mediocre death deck. Hey, fuck you! We can put them to good use. Please choose a card to draw a cost from. Take a cost of one from the Magnist. And another. This time I will use its power and health. The numbers. Three power and two health from the Queen. Now choose a card from which we will extract the sigils. What's that flickering over there? Uh, a sigil of trinket bear from the crystal. My name is Zom, dude. There's no but one final matter: the portrait. I'm gonna smile anyways. Here we go again. Another challenger. Perhaps this time, perhaps you can understand bones. A resourceful person. A person with coarse steel bones. You gain a bone with when one of your creatures perishes for any reason. That seems useful. After this, I'm gonna I'm gonna end the video because this is getting long and I need to edit this and all that. Um, but I'm proud. This pro this series probably is gonna be like um, longer videos because uh, I don't want to have to like cut it up into multiple parts or anything like that. From the death of your creature, you begin to bow. Lose this until it is spent to the battle ends. Alright. Rattler. Can you pick a possum? Resourceful of possum? No, Rattler. Uh, okay. Two more bones. Oh, I forgot your fingerine. Get up and fetch it for me. It's behind the safe. Do you mean beside this? I did I read that as behind? I saw beside. Wait, what? What's that? Skull. Ooh. Ooh. Teeth already. Uh. Why is that safe shaking? Got my little piece. Put that down. Let us continue. Also, I can see how many teeth I got now. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, six. So, start screen. That will be the, the end of this episode of Inscription. I'll see you guys in whatever project I end up making next. But until then, see ya.